Hello guys, namaste dosto. I'm still in Mumbai. As you can see, there is a whole bunch of old historical buildings all around me. Uh, at least in the area I am uh, hanging in. It would be very hard leaving this, this city at least around Kolabar and you know, further actually. It's quite, quite a large area. It's not only, well let's call it South, South Mumbai, right? So, uh, <laughs> it is <coughs> just incredible. Uh, uh, and I cannot stop making a video at least once a day, you know, to you know show you when I pass somewhere and I see, oh my God, this will be interesting to my subscribers. I mean, we just had uh, breakfast, but you know, I, I could have showed you a breakfast, but it maybe it would have been boring because you know I've been, I've been eating puri again, puri bhaji, which is always a great uh, breakfast, and uh, I just had to take care of some business. And I'm meeting my family in the park. And I uh, wanted to show you a little bit, uh, just, a, just a short video, just a, a little, a little, my path to the garden. I've actually, actually ch check out this old building here, which is very nice. It's a Zara shop. And yeah, it's, it is just breathtaking how this whole city, or at least in South Mumbai, I have not seen more than South Mumbai, is just simply breathtaking. It's just simply. You know, I'm, a la I'm a at the lack of words, really. Check this out. I mean, this is probably hundreds of years old, you know, or at least made in that in that architecture style. I mean, I've passed some buildings before, which I thought were really old, but they weren't actually. Anyway, let's go. Let's go on the street. You know, show you a little bit to get a picture. You know, of what it would uh, would be like here. Huh? The onion sky. Uh -huh, what do you say? It is amazing. I like it here. And of course, you have these uh, breakfast or anyway street food stalls everywhere around. At least South Mumbai, right? Uh, I've never seen so many street food stalls like in, like here and uh, see you there again. That's everywhere. I mean, not, no, it's not everywhere, but in certain in certain areas where there's lots of offices, you know, lots of office workers. They go for, 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 for breakfast, they go for lunch, and some, some, some even go for, for dinner at these breakfast, uh, at these food places, which are, you know, which is not only cheap, convenient, but also that prestige thing, you know, like have, have, have some good, good street food, you know. Also, you see these lassi stands, these juice stands everywhere, and oh, well, check it out Skechers. Yeah, I don't even know what this street is called. I must apologize. There's a church. Let's go check it out. Maybe we go inside. <laughs> uh, check, ah, this is being refurbished, but this is nice. I see the pockets over there. So it's not a long video, I promise you guys. I don't want to make you bored. Too bad this is being refurbished, but then again, it's pretty cool because you see how they do it. You know, how, how they put the, these bamboo ladders across the the building, you know. Anyway, so there's, uh, there's no cars allowed, but at least there's filming allowed. Not sure what this is, or I've just I've just come across this actually. I mean, it's quite a large area here, South Mumbai, and and I keep walking around, but I do keep running into things that I have not known. Zero point. Carat de l'Héritage, Saint Thomas Church, built in December 1718. Uh, consider so consecrated as a cathedral in 1837. Well, that's quite a took them all more than 100 years. Anyway, check it out, it's pretty cool. I like it. St. Thomas Cathedral, it's a nice garden. It's a well, I'm checking this out. It's an empty pond, not a pond, it's a fountain. You know, there's no water in it now. Oh, wow! Hello, sir. Can I walk in? Yeah, go inside. Like yes. We do not video shooting. All right, so I could not film inside. I went inside. It's, it's a church. It's an old church. It's always nice, but I don't. I wonder why there's no no video shooting. I see there's some the cathedral grounds here. Some garden. It's nice. Very nice. I right, check it out there again. Uh, lots of houses are being, you know, painted or refurbished at the moment. I'm. I'm I keep running into these houses actually. All right, yeah. Vegetarian restaurant. Hello, a sandwich place here. 
Oh, looks good. <laughs> All right, so let's go just walk down to the park. See this as well. Yeah, so I mentioned that before. It's Adidas shop. This is, I mean, definitely, I mean, Mumbai has done it for me. I mean, it's, it's, it's hot now. Hey, it may super uh, everywhere in India, I suppose, because it's hot summer, right? But Mumbai, I would like to spend a lot of time more in Mumbai. If we just had the visa, you know, I wouldn't have a problem staying here for a few months, you know, finding an apartment. It's not a cheap thing, of course. As particularly in this area in South Mumbai. Check it out, the Starbucks. And this old Victorian building, which is called the Elphinstone building. All right. There's a chroma shop. And then, of course, we're in India. The cows are here for the milk and not for the meat, which is a good thing. An ex exemplary thing, I think. And no, th those are big cows. They're not from Karnataka. Huh? Ah, yeah, yes. Yeah. Big, big, big cows. Wow. <laughs> they see me in his head. Sugar cane juice, chai stop, fruit shop. Wow. And those are, yeah, there's a lot of fruit being eaten in here, around here, and this is a, as a food stall. And the, the interesting part is there's no English writing, it's all Marathi. It's Marathi or Hindi? Marathi or Hindi? Writing. <laughs> No, no, go back me. <laughs> All right, see, uh, that's uh, it's a cool thing. There's no English, and I always find this as a win, you know. See, it's all in Marathi or Hindi or you know, and it looks all the same to me. See these cool buildings here, and this is the what is this? Some kind of a circle. See over there, there are more old buildings, and over there, there are more old buildings, and it's just incredible. The only thing I find sad is that there's not only these old India-made cars they used to have, you know? So it's basically all these imported cars now. I'm not sure if they're all important. I have to be careful what I'm saying because lots of you will be criticizing me for just mumbling ahead, right? Anyway, so in the olden days when I first was in India, there was all these these ambassador cars, you know, these old, these old you know, like uh, fancy cars and they're all taxis, they're all cool. And now you don't see any of them anymore. You see these, you know, regular, whatever they are, cars. I don't know any much, uh, much about cars anyway. So, we got a Lassie shop here, very cool. This is a good Lassie anyway. Yeah, see, cool. I don't know what that is, but it's some kind of fountain, I think. Hello, sir. Alrighty. Cool, huh? check out, this is the garden. Or the park, or what is it called? I think ah, it's got the Hornemann Circle. Ah, this whole thing here is the Hornemann Circle, right? So, take a last look at it. <laughs> so, and this is the Hornemann Gardens, or Circle Gardens, I'm not even sure. Hello, sir. All right, so this is the. Hello, sir. It's a nice little park, it's very nice. It's, uh, I like this, it's very, you know, lots of tropical plants and trees and bushes and some crows. Ah, see, this is what, this is the India they don't show you. I mean, I do realize that lots of vloggers come here and show, like, the poor part of India to gain views or I don't know what they what they think. And it, this is, a, it's, it's a fact, but it's also a fact that there's this, you know, this incredible old park which is just breathtaking I like it it's another another fountain so where's my family now which is not exactly full but they're filling it now maybe they've been cleaning it or nah they'll probably be planning on cleaning it I'm not sure check it out how nice is this uh, by the way someone I asked someone why, why in Mumbai all the trees are, are, are painted and someone told me so they know they can't cut them down. I'm not sure if that's true. So I cannot sell this to you as a as a fact. Let's go over there real quick. Yeah. I think 
all the families over there in the playground. Um, isn't that nice? I mean, hello. What a perfect garden. What a perfect park, you know. I mean, I'd like to live here, but not, you know, not like slaving away at some job, you know. But I'm doing what I'm doing, you know, and then going to have a nice breakfast and come chill in the park and check out these old buildings. I mean, I hope I do not insult anybody because I saw so much, so much excitement over these old British buildings here in Mumbai. But it's just, I mean, I, and I love Indian buildings, you know, uh, the architecture, the, the temples and all. It's just, it's just a very different thing. I'm not sure, if I, in, 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 in Bangalore, I did not see this, you know. I did not see these buildings. I'm, I'm, I'm sure, I mean, I saw a few cool parks there too, right? It's, which is called uh, the City of Gardens, right? Or the Garden City, yeah. But, yeah. This is just a small neighborhood park, really, you know. There's nothing, I mean, I wouldn't say there's nothing special about it. Because there's a lot special about it. There's a lot special about Mumbai. A lot special about India, you know. This is not just a, yeah. I can understand that sometimes I show, you know, like the real India. Of course, there's this there's, there's rich, there's poor, there's, there's there's old, there's new, there's the whole whole shebang, right? And I get criticized for showing, sometimes showing some, you know, some shabby stuff or old stuff, which I like, you know, which is quite interesting. But I'm not here to make a buck on showing the poverty. So, but I'm, I'm showing, I'm here to show, basically, you know, what India's about, right? Or at least parts of it you know I only have so much time and capabilities are you know limited kind of like so there you go have this very nice park and that's the Asiatic Society Mumbai 1804 State Central Library Town Hall <laughs> it looks like the White House almost huh? it just does not stop with the old historical buildings and here you can have you can work out here you got everything you need. There's one guy working out, showing you how many push-ups you can do. Yeah, there's a playground, right? Where's my fam? Ah, oh, they're over there. Ah, oh, yeah, that's the cool thing about Mumbai. I'm not sure if this is all over India. I have not. I've definitely noticed this in Mumbai. There's these swings at the parks, you know. And the 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 see this dude. I mean, of course, most most people are working now, right? That is sitting. He's sitting there. Oh, my family's sitting there. See? This, oh, and check out this old tree here, which is so amazing, huh? Yeah, some old men hanging out in the garden. And it's my family, sitting on a swing. All right, huh? So how are you guys doing? All good? Yeah, it's so cozy. It's very nice. Actually, I walked down, I, I walked down there, and uh, it's an amazing street. Just lots of old buildings. and. Yeah. Anyway, so that was my short video. Uh, watch it if you like. Like it if you want. And share it if you want. Alright, guys? Uh, you'll see me in my next video. Alright? Bye-bye, guys. For the blingy.